What is going on my fellow scumbags and welcome back to another episode on Feudal Server. In the last episode, I showed off my killbox skills and showed you guys why I'm a killbox god. Got into a friendly bar fight with the community and then I got into a legit fight with Psycho's crew. In this episode, the gang and I encounter our first raiders and they weren't playing nice. So I hope you guys do enjoy the video and if you do, a like would be dope as hell and dog bless you. And subscribe if you want more content like this. But really quick, guys, this video is sponsored by the Tech One Medical Association. Enjoy. Hi, I'm Dr. Dick L. Long with the Tech One Corporation. Here on Scum Island, we like to provide all of our prisoners with the best medicine in all of Croatia. If you are looking for some medicine, then look no further than the sanitarium. The sanitarium is here to fulfill all of your medical needs. We have rags, rag strips, rubber bands, scissors, and many more. If you are looking for a hemostatic presser dressing or maybe a tourniquet, then you have come to the wrong place, my friend. It's quite hilarious to see prisoners take a long trip all the way to the sanitarium in hopes of finding some high tier medical items. But you dumb motherfuckers, that is not how things work here on Scum Island. You see, the truth of the matter is you are never going to find any high tier medical items for the simple fact that we do not have them in stock. So come on down to the sanitarium where you will be utterly disappointed. We're located on the south end of Zagreb, and here at Tech One Corporation, we promise that you won't find jack shit here. I'm Dr. Dick L. Long, and stay toasty out there, prisoners. So the homies and I were spending a couple of days trying to upgrade the base. We hit up the brick factory for some bricks, hit the quarry for some gravel, and hit the factory and B1 for some concrete. But the mech's pretty dangerous to maneuver around over there, so I said fuck that and built a desk and made a makeshift TV, and the homies and I went to work transferring concrete super easy. And really quick, crafting these damn sandbags is annoying as hell, but we got that done. And then Nick hit me with a bag of gravel, and we got into an intense pillow fight. Aw, oh, you fucking bitch. I wasn't even paying attention. I just like that you lose no health from this. It's a pillow fight, bro. <laughs> fuck, 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 Nick's there. Run away from Nick. Fuck you, Luke. No! <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> oh shit! Oh shit! Yeah, yeah. Oh shit! Come here. Uh, oh, you lucky bitch. bitch. Oh fuck me. Fuck you. I didn't go oh, down. You didn't fall. You didn't go down. Oh! <laughs> oh! Oh! You oh, sneaked oh, in both of you guys. In both of you guys. <laughs> oh fuck you up, Nick. Oh, you missed! Oh, you mean you fucking... Uh, I don't know, you teleported. Fuck you. Fuck. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> oh, <laughs> shit! <laughs> alright, alright, let's do last round, last round, last round. Uh, alright, go ahead, loot. Three, two, one, go, fight. No, I fucked up. Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. I needed to take a shit, and Feudal thought it would be fun to drop some explosive puppets on us, and blew up some of our boxes in the process. Nick and I were really messed up by the explosion, so Dr. Loaf tried to come to his rescue and patch him up. But Feudal wanted us to get to 100% health again, so he spawned in a puppet to kill us. Easy. We had to deal with all of his shenanigans, and I mean all of his shenanigans. But I did level up my handgun skill, so that was tight. He spawned in a bunch of wolves, more explosive puppets, and a big ass horde of puppets. And even though we were tortured, we got a fuck ton of wolves to eat. And I think that was a perfect payout for dealing with feudal shit. The homies and I wanted to get out of the house, and Invictus was telling us about a little spot to hit not too far away. So we headed towards the base, and your boy gets at it with the pick locking. But none of us had gloves, so I died. Last one, boys. I'm gonna die. Fucking love you guys. But Luton picked me up, and I went back at it again. Alright, goodbye, boys. 
I wanted to gear up and grab some gloves back at base and hit that lock again, but I was welcome with something else when I got into the room. Oh, shit. What, what? someone there? Someone just killed me. Oh, God. Are you in the base? Uh, I'm gonna hey, fuck you, you guy. What's up? You're going to give me your screwdriver. That's not many options you're giving me, sir. Well, that's, that's what you're getting. I'm telling you right now, I will pick through those two doors up there. Yeah. Faster than you fucking think. And Promise? So, either you can just be cool and I don't have to take any of your guns and ammo and all that shit, or I can come in and I can take everything. So, it's up to you, brother. I reach these literally kids. Literally, all I want is the drivers. I, I'm not gonna. I'm literally not capping. I'm not gonna. You're gonna open the door and I'm gonna fucking shoot you. I just want the drivers to go raid somebody else. So it's either I'm gonna raid you, or and take the shit, or you can give them to me and I'll just leave. And then you're We're coming in hot. Uh, so like, wait, where? Shit. On the roof, on the roof, on the roof, you'll be on the roof up next to us, to our, uh, to our north. Oh, shit. He's on top of the roof. I am hit like a motherfucker. As am I. He's on top of the roof, towards the northeast. He's by our door, he's by our door to the right. He's definitely looting someone. Okay, he's looting my body, I'm right in front. Ah, oh, got me. There's one running back towards uh, the uh, church. For sure. Where were you? Out in I was front. in the apartment. They're, they're running towards the uh, thing. They're about to be right out there by my body. Oh, far as fuck. They shooting at you? Yeah, there they are. They're in that apartment building. Oh god, I never fucking reloaded. There's one right out by the truck. I think I got him. I heard a die. I heard someone die. That was me. I hit him. He's hot. Yeah, I think. Oh, I fucked up. Where was he? He's right out in front of the truck. I hit Buddy though. Outside, outside the apartment, outside the apartment. I got him. Call. All right, who's gonna loot? Who's that? Loot and got him. Good shit. I need uh, I need to get bandaged and healed. Though. Yeah, can somebody heal me though? Thank you. I'm healing. I'm healing. I'm gonna search the dude in the back. Oh, uh, let me let me claim his kill. You can claim his kill. You're right. All right. Yo, shit. Cow juice. Shit. Hey! Hey! You better get out of here. Rude boys have to come out there and fuck you up again. It's over hey! Here. He's over here. He's over here. Quit banging on my goddamn dough! Fucking kids! How did he sneak in? What, what the fuck? In? How the fuck he get in? How did that explode? What did it explode? He blew up. There's a mine. Who is this? Mellow. How did he get in? How the fuck did he get in? Oh, yeah, dude. This is an easy way to jump over. This motherfucker just ran up in here in oranges. <laughs> God damn. That's oh, fuck. There's a dude. Where is he? Hey. I killed him. Did you kill him? Yeah. Since those guys had some big brains to jump over into our base, we started to build a wall so they couldn't jump in again. Oh, there's a dude. Oh shit, I just got hit with a spear behind there. Right back there, right back there. He's over here now, over here now. By the other building. Hey, buddy! 
Oh. Oh shit, I got sniped. Fuck. Since there was a sniper out and about, I thought it'd be smart to throw some smoke grenades so we could get back our gear, and it went pretty smoothly. So I ran back in and almost got shot while opening up the doors, and that would have not been cash money. So I got on top of the roof to scout where the sniper was and hopefully take him down. Got him. You got him. Yeah. Oh, I see him. Got him. I killed him. Hold on, no. I wanna go check on your friend. He dead as hell. Oh, I fucking missed. Good shit. See another one. I can see nothing inside of I killed him. Where was he? He was uh, right beside the church in the bushes. There's another one. You shooting? Yeah, there's another one. What? What? Where's he at? Yo, let me chop up that body and I'm trying to give you a present. Did you get my first one? Let him chop up the body. And shoot him. All he wanted to do was chop up the body. As soon as he done chop and shoot. <laughs> oh, he got me. Oh, we're dead. I think they're throwing nades. He got me. I know where his ass is at though. The fight literally went on until the morning and these guys were still banging on my door, which was pissing me off. So we blew off some steam and did an event real quick. And when we came back here, these guys were still here. Hey, what the hell is you crafting? Who was that? I just killed both of them and they flipped me up. Fuck them. There were some issues that came up where Mello was mistaken for another player and was banned. So with all that shit going on, I felt really bad and I wanted to be nice. And I gave this man some Scroogies and a gun that he had lost. And I even gave some more gear so him and his homie can match too. And you would think that they would be cool and not really mess with us again. Especially after I gave him all that loot. But we were sadly mistaken. Stay toasty out there, my fellow scumbags.